Alright everybody, how are we, what is going on, and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to give my uh, reaction, my unbiased, unfiltered, and uh, well, mostly unedited, although I do edit it a little bit, but uh, with my reactions, you know, I just try and be me. If I want to pause it, I'll pause it. If I want to say something, I'll say something. If I want to break something down, I'll break something down. If I hear something that I want to check the stats on, I'll check it. And you guys roll with it, and I really enjoy that, and I think... I think we're just going to have to keep going. So with that being said, today we're going to be looking at Leonard Fournette against the Jets. Now really, the only the only two things I cared about with the Jets this year is um, their running back, being Le'Veon Bell, uh, seeing what, what he's made of. You know, last season was, was the season that I actually started following the league, and it was the season that he decided not to play. So I don't know that my opinions of him were too high, but he is a six-foot running back, 220 pounds, nice spin move. And that's basically all I know. Uh, today we're actually looking at his opposite from this game, which is Leonard Fournette. The only other thing I cared about with the Jets was Valentine Holmes, the ex-NRL rugby league player from Australia who went through the, the 2019 uh, International Pathway program with the IMG Academy. And he had the, the Undiscovered series on YouTube, which I enjoyed immensely. Unfortunately, he... Played okay in his preseason games, but nothing crazy. Actually got hit a couple of times really quite hard. And he looked kind of small out there, which was always going to be a factor. He didn't make the squad, and he actually decided to come back to Australia. And he has just signed a six-year deal, which basically takes him up to the age of 30, with the North Queensland Cowboys here in the NRL once again. So uh, he's, done with, he's done his stint in the NFL. He didn't make it as such. But, you know, he's always going to have those few, few clips of him playing for the Jets. And I guess, you know, it's more than most people can say. So with that being said, let's get into Leonard Fournette weaving his way through the Jets with 136 total yards. October 27th, 2019. Let's go. On second and eight, Fournette. I missed that. DJ Chark on second and eight, Fournette. Straight through. Oh, come on. Inside Tell me you score that. Tell me you score that. Get there. Ah, oh, it's just like the other fucking run. Seen three like that now. Right up the gut, Fournette. Show the wheels. Inside Jets territory. One man to beat. Fournette still going. Adams and Roberts giving chase, and it's his ex-teammate at LSU, Adams, with a touchdown-saving tackle. They're one of the best, if not the if the best. Inside zone running football team. Oh man, how did they catch him? It was Adams. Good tackle. Good tackle, but you know what could he have actually done? What could what could Leonard Fournette have done to, to get there? With a touchdown saving tackle. To make sure he gets to the end zone. Probably could have just kept running. Kept running that way. But he's changed Inside. direction once, and again, and again. Well, he's absolutely bamboozled his opposite number, Roberts. And, uh, well, Adam just obviously just pins his ears back and hopes for the best. And lo and behold, I don't think Fournette saw him coming. Chemist has just signed off their practice squad last couple of years under Greg Williams in Cleveland. Williams loves him. Beat him. And I knew he was going to beat him. Yeah. What a spin by Fournette. Nice step, bro. What a spin. You could tell that was going to happen, though. Fournette sees his defender coming. He's like, fuck, I've got to stick something in the ground. Sticks his left in. Spins around him. Yards after contact. Let's go. Last couple of years under Greg Williams in Cleveland. Williams loves See, up in the air. Literally, he's going to bring his right foot down. His left foot is going to be the stepping foot. He already knows what he's doing. He's going to spin the shit out of it and go downfield. Bang! Look at that. Don't you just love it? And thrust into a roll today with the injuries they've had at linebacker. What a spin by Fournette. That was Adams again. Bastard. Play action from Minshew. Who set it up with a couple of nice completions. Fournette. Out of the backfield, he has had to work awfully hard. And we know how he's got it. And aggressive Greg Williams likes to be with That's him. what I'm talking about, Fournette. Back yourself to the right. Bounce out there. Do a fucking Barkley. Because look, there ain't nothing going on with your O-line. Played well. Fournette breaking a tackle. 
As slippery as he been with that power, he is the complete package for this Jacksonville offense. Run out of bounds by Hairston. So I wouldn't yes, be surprised to see the Jets play a little bit more zone. Another reception. Goes underneath, here's Fournette. See, that's an exciting time for me as a fan. To see Fournette with the ball in space. He's just bet a defender. Well, I'm actually surprised he, he ran out, although he did make sure he got a first down, so. That's beautiful. Well, we've seen that impressive spin maneuver a couple of times by Fournette. Nate Hairston on the tackle. Mitchie, play action. Underneath Fournette. Yes! Backfield. Fournette breaking free. Oh. I just think that's Adams playing hard. Minshew gets rid of the ball and he runs into him. But again, we just were right. Play clock down to one. Minshew on third and ten. Fournette has a step. He makes the catch. Gardner Minshew sees the matchup with his running back or tight end on a defensive. What happened there? It was a screen, wasn't it? Chark comes through. Fournette goes behind Chark. And this fella, what's he looking at? He's looking at. Sees the matchup with. Okay, so the ball. The ball's with Minshew. This fella is looking at Minshew. When does he divert his attention to Fournette? Running. Well, straight away, actually. Back. Doesn't he? I'd call that a hold, wouldn't you? Right end on a defensive end. This is a blitz, and Willis is responsible. Lucky didn't get called on that. All right, so that was a. Shit, that was a short one, wasn't it? Um, ah, what do we do here, Leonard? Because this is actually the last of, of of the highlights. I feel like we're we're not doing him justice. We haven't seen too much. Seen that, seen that. We're gonna see that for net 2019-20 highlights. Oh, best plays from. Oh no, that was a year ago. <laughs> we can't do that one. Highlights versus the Titans. Well, I've actually seen that already. There's not a huge amount of Leonard Fournette highlights from this this year, but we will we will finish it off with uh, this one. There's Fournette. Oh no, that's not what you want. That ain't what you want. Fournette on the burst, out to the side, open space. Two defenders already taken up. This is your job, buddy. 49. Come on, mate. What do you got? What do you got? I ain't got nothing! Right <laughs> tackle. Oh, no. It's another one. Damn, that's a nice run. Oh! Matt lowers his shoulder, runs into and over Bobby McCain, and picks up 12 yards, and now a little bit of traction for this Jaguars offense. Was that 49? Well, Linder, number 65, the sender, he comes off... He's able to get on the linebacker. That no, was 28. He helps open up that hole and... No, that was a shit one. I did see another video though. Leonard Fournette highlights versus the Panthers. 108 rushing yards. Let's have a look at this one. Oh, flags there. Here we go. There we go, that's what you want. Oh, I'd hate to be that defender coming up to him, I, t I swear. Yeah, Fournette! Fuck! Oh my god, the one thing... I'm going to mention it again, I've done it in previous videos. Chuck is there, waiting for the lateral. Okay? He's fucking there! Literally could have done a little pop pass, little lateral inside to your man, like they do in rugby. It's a beautiful finish for a touchdown. But it's just like, yeah, I mean, ball security is, is number one. I understand. So it's not going to happen. But I can't help but want it to. <laughs> Goes in hard, man. Oh, yeah. I like that. I like that. Another first down. 
sticks. He just shoved out of bounds by Shaq Thompson, but he's got enough for a first. I was 13 when I lost my virginity. Fast. Excuse me? 1,220 views. Fresh print sports. Well, thanks, mate. Thanks a lot. Uh, guys, that is the end of the video for today. There is one other video, and it's a film study. It's by a channel called Jackson Kruger Sports. And uh, it's going to be the first time I watch a video of his, and it's going to be the first time I actually see some, some, some film study of, of Leonard Fournette. I'm going to see also whether they talk about how he's most effective, whether it's staying behind his, his O-line, whether it's on an inside zone play or an outside zone play or a toss play or even uh, you know swinging out to the left or right being open receiving the pass and then trying to beat players up the field he's a multifaceted player and that's fantastic especially great for me who uh, who enjoys watching him so anyways guys that's gonna be the next one I hope you enjoyed probably the final time you'll see me react to uh, Leonard Fournette's highlights until he is named in the top 100 players of 2020 because we all know it's gonna happen and if it doesn't, I'll be very, very, very disappointed, just like I was last year. So I'll see you in the next one, guys. Have a fantastic day. Peace out. Okay, I've been working like three jobs. Probably why I never see ya. Probably why I never have time for the fake friends. I won't be ya. Oh, God, I've been running now.